Hello there and welcome to Chris Hall Motorcycles in Doncaster and welcome to the channel guys. So before we get stuck into this really nice um, iconic bike, uh, don't forget just tick that subscribe button for me, hit the like button and tick that bell for notifications. So like I say we've got this fairly legendary iconic machine in front of me now, it's the 2017 BMW R1200 GS. Um, and like I say, over the years these have become really well sought after, a bit of an iconic legendary machine now. S partly thank you to uh, a couple of uh, actors that decided to ride around the world on them. So, um, but they are a very good machine and um, very popular as you know. So this is, like I say, this is 2017. Let me just give you some bullet points before we have a quick walk around. Uh, 2017, it's done 14,400 miles, uh, I've got two keys, service book, owner's manual, six service stamps in the book, so well looked after, and the last service was about, I'm going to say 350 miles ago, um, and it's got some nice extras on it as well, which we'll get into as we walk around the bike. It's fairly standard to be fair, but there are a few nice little bits on it. Um, so let's start at the back of the bike, lovely clean rear rack. Uh, let me put my glasses on so I can see what I'm doing. As you can see, that rear tyre is, I don't think, I mean, it's still got the little nobbles just here. I don't know if you can see that. That is a new tyre. There's a brand, yeah, that's a, rear, a, a new rear tyre, that, as you can see. I'm going to say that's done a couple of miles at worst, just to, um, you know, it's got the... Uh, rear wheel protector on there as well uh, lovely nice and clean in there but yeah that, that's a new tyre no scuffs or marks on the exhaust or anything like that that is nice and clean and again inside uh, you know the suspension and what have you that's all nice well looked after bit of kit uh, you get two seat height positions on these so that's in its higher position there obviously when it's in a lower position you always tell there's a bit more of a gap just there We've got the engine crash bars fitted, which is a, a must on these. Engine casing all nice and clean. Tank, again, no dents, no scratches. Nice colour, actually, this, the silver with the blue. Always looks very classy. Uh, we've got heated grips, factory fitted on this particular bike as well, as we work our way around. Nice, clean, everywhere, basically. Front tyre. Again, again, I'm going to say that looking at the edges on these, the tread, I'm going to say that that is a new tyre as well. So, new boots, front and rear on this bike. Come around this side, we've got a fender extender down here as well. But overall, a nice, clean example. No dents, no scratches anywhere to be made aware of. It's got a centre stand. Uh, what else have we got? Oh, we've got the rear hugger, mudslinger, hugger in there, don't know if you can see that very well on the camera, do not really show it because it's that dark in there, um, but yeah it's got one of those on it as well, uh, again the rear swing arm, the shaft drive etc, all really nice and clean, so yeah overall just a real nice clean 14 and a half thousand mile example of one of these and uh, they are good bits of kit, we've got the um, BMW sat nav bracket as well, so let's just put some life in this uh, in this bike and let it fire itself up. Okay, battery's really, really weak. Let's have one more go on this. Let me just have, oh no. There we go. There we go. This bike needs a good run. I'm not going to edit, edit that out, I'm going to leave that in because that's a real world situation. Um, but no, we'll get that on trickle charge in a minute. But that is a nice, nice bike, sounds lovely. Wow, we've actually got some fuel. That's a first. Wow, that's a first. We've got fuel, but very limited power. Uh, the irony. So yeah, we'll get that on charge. I won't, like I say, I won't edit that out because you know this is this is real world. You know, I'm, we're not trying to uh, 
present something that's not factual as it were so uh, we'll just get that on charge you know modern batteries are pretty rubbish as we both know so um yeah so there you go folks that's the 2017 is it 2017 on a 66 yeah 2017 on a 66 bmw r1200 gs just under 14 and a half thousand miles i've got two keys owner's manual service book hpi report six service stamps in the book lovely clean bike last serviced about 350 miles ago um this bike will be supplied with a full mot a three month warranty with ourselves and it will go through the workshop prior to coming out for a full check over we can offer finance on this vehicle and we can also offer nationwide or international delivery also um if you want to come pick this bike up and get the train up to us Give us a call, we'll pick you up from the train station, not a problem at all. You know, it's um train station is only a couple of miles away from us, but it's an undesirable walk, I think we can call it. Um so yeah, uh, just give us a give us a call, we'll pick you up. Um okay guys, so if you've got any questions on this bike or any of our others, don't hesitate, give me a call 01302 760 967, or you can email me chrisalmotorcycles at googlemail.com com alternatively if you are thinking of coming down to view the bike in person you're more than welcome uh, as always if you are traveling give me a call before you set off just to make sure the bike is in stock and available for viewing but other than that guys i'm going to sign this one off i've been rabbiting way past my five minutes so if you're still here and still watching which i'd like to think most of you are don't forget, hit that like button and subscribe to this channel. We've got a lot of bikes coming for you this week. I'm trying to get busy. Um, I'm going to start digging out some classics, um, particularly vintage trials bikes, if that's your area of uh, like. We're going to get some uh, bull tacos out later today, hopefully. So anyway, I'm out of here. Thank you very much for watching. I really do appreciate the support, guys. And I uh, hope to see you all very soon. And don't forget, the kettle is always on. Have a good day. Cheers.